Come on now. Everyone wake up. It's almost showtime. Just watch this. short one who's always hungry. I'm Paul. I'm the tall one who's got the attitude. And, and together, together we, we are known as the Two Amigos. Where is this place? You don't know where you are, do you? This is the home of happiness and eternal smiles. Welcome, young lady, to Smile Land. Smile Land? Welcome to Smile Land, the amazing amusement city dedicated to putting a permanent smile on the face of each and every customer. That's right! This entire town has been transformed top to bottom into a fantastic adventure park! Because of that, every man, woman, and kitty is always laughing and smiling and having the time of their lives all year long! And of course, in order to keep a smile on everybody's face, they gotta keep working hard to come up with brand new animals and characters all the time! And they gotta work hard to make sure all the attractions and characters that people are tired of are gone before you know it. And that's where we are. The fabulous garbage dump of Smile Land. Huh? <laughs> 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 Phew, that was close. By the way, what's your name, young lady? And what brings you to this neck of the woods? I'm Kino. I was on a trip with Vince and Riel. We were all riding on the rabbit. She saved Vince? And Riel? Then do you know them? We've, We've never, never heard, heard of them! them. The weirdo the whole wide world over is the two amigos! <laughs> <laughs> I wonder, do you think I've been thrown away too? What do I do about this? What to do? What to do? Man, this is quite a pickle. That's it! When you're in trouble, ask someone for help! All right! You see, the two of us are in a bit of a sticky situation ourselves. This is perfect! Now we're all in a mess together! Who are you going to ask for help? That's a silly question. 
we're going to ask the creator of Smile Land to help us. The incredible Mr. Will Be Good. Stick to the script, will ya? We don't have time for your shenanigans. So you think he's an informant? It's obvious we're being bugged. Don't you talk to me like I'm not here. I ain't gonna let you walk all over me. Who are you? Oh, brother, you're a bit thick, ain't ya? Little girl, I'm this episode's special guest. You're gonna need more help than these two louses can give. Sheesh, I've been looking all over for you. How'd you get mixed up with these two dimwits? For the record, I'm Rogie the Cricket. Pleased to meet ya. My name's Pino, and I'm kinda looking for Vince and Riel. Just as I suspected! Do you know where they are? Of course! And if you come with me to Will Be Good's house, you'll find out where they are! Alio! Let's go! What about... Oh, oh. oh those two? Yeah. You don't need them anymore. Huh? Eh, don't sweat the details. This stuff's as strong as a spider silk. Uh... Grab a all your notes yeah that's okay we figured just asking for help wouldn't be enough so we're gonna have to take some direct action knock it off why are you guys still following us we're going to go see will be good to find out why we were born he's gotta know after all if you think about it he's the one who created us in the first place what fooey you just completely changed what you said in the first place I bet you're not even listening anymore. There must be some reason we were created. And that's just what we're planning on finding out! A reason? Wow. Either way, it doesn't matter, cause this story ain't about you. So you two get out of here. But we want to see Will! We're coming! Can we bring Alan Poole along with us, oh please? <sighs> I knew we should have just left them behind. I know. Let's deal. I'll let the two maroons tag along with us if you agree to answer a question. What? Your friend Vince. What kind of person is he? Vince is really kind to me, and he loves me very much. And because Vince loves Riel a lot, I love both of them a lot, too. Uh, that's not the sort of thing I was talking about. More like, what makes Vince Vince? I don't know, but he likes to worry about stuff all the time. Oh, and then sometimes, he'll change and get really big and strong. Gotcha. So, does Vince have any kind of weaknesses? Huh? Hey! Vino! Over here! Come take a look! Sheesh! We don't have time for this. like fun. Wish I were a customer. Boy, it sure does. Wish I were a customer. But, but together, together, we, we are, are the three amigos! Come on, we gotta hurry up and skedaddle over to Mr. Good's house now. Ah, hey, don't you dare go outside! around apparently it's to let everyone know that the world is coming to an end you got nothing to do with us though right <laughs> hey lame brain you born yesterday everyone includes you and me too it's the end of the whole world Armageddon is coming soon 
Are you still ignoring me? I heard Mr. Good's been locked up in his room for ages, working on some great new story. Yeah, I heard that too. I also heard he's got writer's block. Oh, for the love of Pete, just forget about all that, will you? Let's hurry up and get over to Will's place. Come on, people! Hello there! Yeah. Do all of you have your park passes? No. No. So, thought you could just ride for free, eh? Uh, I told you so. Pino, run! <laughs> After her! Come back! <laughs> wow, this is cool! You're coming with me! <laughs> Look, it's a little girl. No! <laughs> this is cool. Look at her smile. It's so natural. <laughs> I've never seen a smile like that. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, it's just so natural. Pino! This ride is over! No! I won't have any ad libbing in Smile Land! <sighs> That was really great, Pino. It looked like a lot of fun, Pino. It was a lot of fun, Pino. Because it kind of reminded me of this one time, a long time ago, that my papa took me to the shopping mall. Wow, I didn't know machines had papas. But I haven't seen him for a really long time. How oh, sad. Your papa, you miss him? Mm, mm -mm. I'm okay now. How? He's your papa. I have really good friends who take care of me now. You mean Vincent? Riel! I hope you find them. Oh. How about you two? What will you do after you see Mr. Good? Hmm. Well, the attraction we lived in is long gone now. Aha! I think I'd like to try being a customer! Wow! I was just about to say the same thing! Get a clue! You guys keep changing what you want, and you're still not listening to me! A customer? As a customer? We could keep smiling forever. Do you people have any idea how much trouble you're in? <coughs> Here you go, Inspector Pooch. <clears throat> Let's see. Now who's first? Let's start with a little guy. Rogie, huh? You're a surveillance type auto rave, right? And you two, Al and Paul, you're both entertainment type auto raves. Says here you're members of the Commedia dell'arte attraction. For you. What? This says that the Commedia dell'arte was shut down. You two should already be in the garbage bin. Hmm. And you are our biggest problem. We don't have any record of you at all. Pino. You're who? I'm Pino. Ah, sweet biscuit! Sir, she's smiling spontaneously. Get a hold of yourself, Lieutenant Kitty. But, sir... Yes, it certainly is a very realistic-looking smile. Must be new software. No, it's not software. I got a soul after I met my friends Vincent Riel. That's why I can smile whenever I'm feeling happy. <gasps> oh. oh, now that's a smile. Absolutely dazzling. Come on! We don't have time for this fun! <laughs> hey, nitwits! How's this story gonna stay interesting if we can't even get the second act up and running? I'm gonna take charge and boot you slows right into the third act! Welcome all to my special corner of the Earth, Smile Land. Mr. Will be good! Holy cow, it's our creator! That's right. 
My name is Will Be Good. And this is the magical world that I created where everyone could have a smile. Yes, it looks easy to make a smile, but it's really a complicated job. Any Tom, Dick, or Harry can make a smile last a second. For me, a smile that lasts a second won't do. I want a smile that lasts a lifetime. For example, did you know that people can enjoy being frightened? Did you know that sometimes people start crying when they're happy? It's so tricky. That's why, in order to create a perfect smile, you need an environment you can control. That's why I created Smile Land. For that pure, sweet smile that must be protected. That wonderful smile that spreads happiness all across the world. I wanted to make a place where people could forget about reality. A place where they wouldn't feel the least bit frightened until the very end. Yes, the citizens of Smile Land enjoy themselves from the moment they're born until the day they die. And when the end of the world inevitably comes, they won't know a thing. They'll just be as happy as ever. Isn't that amazing? Yeah, it's amazing. Good. Now, Pino, you wanted to see Vince and Riel again, isn't that right? You know about that? But of course. I know about everything. I am the creator, after all. I was hoping you might tell me something in exchange. What's Vincent's... No, I mean, what's Ergo Proxy's weakness? Well, that's weird. I thought he said he knew everything. Come on, you can tell me. It'll be our little secret. I don't know. I see. So you don't want to see them again? Yes, I do. Then tell me what I need to know, okay? I don't know. It's the truth. All right. Something else, then. Does Vincent keep a sort of treasure, perhaps? I know you can think of something. Please, think real hard. Be a good little girl, all right? Does Vince have a treasure? I don't know. You really don't know? I really don't know. I see. That's too bad. You see, young lady, if you did have Vince's treasure, I could grant you anything you wanted in the whole wide world. That's a lie. Oh, good. Well, miss, if I'm a liar, then what's behind you? Who are you? What do you mean, who? It's us, silly. It's us, Alan Pull. Mr. Good turned us into customers. Huh? I helped make their wishes come true. Understand? All I want is to help make your wish come true now, Pino. Trust me. Please? I am the creator of Smile Land. You know you can trust me. Now. Hey, there's something phony about that smile, isn't there? What? I mean, when comparing, Pino's is so natural. Yours seems, I don't know, kind of forced. Like it was painted on or something. It doesn't seem to have much substance. He's a faker. It's not like Pino's smile at all. <sighs> Silence! How dare you! You can't criticize me. I created all of you characters in the first place. Got it? You don't get to do anything unless I tell you to. And I won't have anyone else going off the script. All right. You want to know the reason you exist? You don't have a reason to exist. You're nothing but some rejected ideas. You're useless and barely worth the price of your scrap. Hmm? What's that? <laughs> Wait, please. There's no more time left. Please, Pino, you have to tell Vince and Riel not to come here to Smile Land. I beg you. Huh? 
Listen closely. Vincent is on his way here as we speak. We're both proxies. When the two of us meet, we're going to have to fight. Really? Yes. And if we fight, I won't be able to maintain this place anymore. That means... you'll all die? Yes. That's why... I invaded your dreams like this and tried to get you to show me Vince's weakness. I tried, but it didn't work. This is a dream? You mean it's not real? This is a dream, and not a dream. You're full of baloney! I think you're trying to trick Pino again! No, it's the truth. Please believe me. Either way, the world will soon be destroyed. It's all our fate. Until then, let me have my world. Let me be happy with whatever time I have left. I just don't want to fight anymore. Pino, can you do this for us, please? Yeah! We just want to smile to the end. Thanks to you, Pino, we can now smile from the heart. Amigos. I can hear the pulse of the awakening. It won't be long now. Charging your battery? Hey, Vince. Can you come down here, please? What? There they are. What's going on with you? Hey, Pino, look over there. I think I can see some lights on the horizon. Maybe it's a town. It'd be great if we got to resupply. But I'll settle for a rest stop. A town? It can't be. A short circuit. Don't go there! Stop being so difficult. I have to save my amigos! Amigos? Listen to me! If you go there, something bad is gonna happen! I just know! Something bad! <sighs> Leave it alone! Please, you guys! Just trust me! Smileland was saved by one little girl. We thank you, our special girl with a smile. Thank you, Pino!
boring paradise brings back memories. It's warm and pleasant as we chart our way. Goodbye, Vincent.